Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is Helton's Computer Repair here with a video for you. If you pretty much notice, you can probably I'm going ahead and exit out. I don't know, I had a browser open. You pretty much have a point that when you come on here and you want to look for your old classic calculator, it looks a slightly different and it has changed. So pretty much when Windows 10 came out, they replaced it with a new universal UWP pretty much version. So it's somewhat, but if you're a fan that doesn't want this and you want to bring the classic calculator from Windows 7, we're going to be showing you how to do that. So let's go ahead and get started. So first thing you do, pretty simple, to go ahead and open up a browser. doesn't really matter what browser you have. I'm pretty much opening up Edge, the new Edge that pretty much runs up by Chrome and Base. And we're going to go to a website called Win7 Games. And technically, I've already made a video before. That's probably, probably why it came up. Regards, just type in win the number seven games.com and click it and it tells us about this for it and on the top area it says games classic calculator sticky notes um, task manager ms config classic paint and or uh, screensaver pretty much what we're gonna look for is just the classic calculator so I'll move slightly down it tells us that pretty much that Microsoft has to move the classic calculator app in Windows 10 blah 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 they replaced it with a new one blah 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 not a problem regardless I just Click that and scroll down until you see the download calculator. Go ahead and click it. And on the right side, or depending if you have like Chrome or something like that, it might be on the bottom area. Find your location and pretty much just open up that zip folder. Now, technically, if you didn't automatically have it there, just went to general location, just find where it's located. And you can pretty much just click the folder too, and you can right click and you can extract it using if you have Windows 7. Um, we have Windows 7. 7 zip installed on there, or if not, you can just use the regular Windows 10 that comes in there and press the extract underneath the compress folder tools, and it'll pretty much do the same work. So here we are, and just to show the extracted files, I'm going to do the work. And now it expanded pretty much. So here's the folder that I actually did create. So there's old calculator, and there's the folder of it. Same thing. And here's the exe file. Technically, I honestly, you can probably just run the file underneath the zip folder there too, but I decided to show you how to do it anyway. So here we are, open up the old calculator in Windows 10, go ahead and click it. And you'll probably be prompted, go ahead and press yes. And here we are, it tells us install our language, select what language you want, has all different languages. I'm gonna go ahead and leave mine as the English. And I'm gonna go ahead and press install. It went super quick, so I guess it didn't really take too much long. And it tells us finish. So now if I X this out, I can pretty much X out the website if I really don't need it anymore. I don't want to even mind X it out. I can pretty much go to start, and then there's the calculator that's there. So let me give it a try and see what happens. So it's still bringing the new calculator. So let's figure out where the old one is. Is it called the old calculator? Or is games came in place right here? So I already made a video on that before for it. Let me see if I can just search calculator. Depending on this, I might need to... Oh, there it is. The old calculator is there. I just don't know where exactly where it's at. So here's the old classic calculator there. Let's see where we can find it, or if not, Windows might needs to be restarted for this. Let's see. That's there. Microsoft. I don't technically see it there. Windows System is it right there. Oh, it says Windows Accessories. Oh, and there it is. So it's underneath the folder underneath Windows Accessories, and there's the calculator for it. So that's where you can locate it. And that's pretty much it. Thank you for watching from Helton's Computer Repair, and I will see you on the next video. Thanks for watching, guys. If you just like this video, then hit that button. But if you like it and you want to see more, hit that like button. Get subscribed, comment, and tell us what other tech videos you want to see. Consider checking out our merch store. Link in the video description. And for the rest, I will see you on the next video.